With yet another holiday weekend on the horizon, local leaders are worried about another spike. In the Canyon Lake area, officials announced today they will be closing certain recreational areas on weekends and holidays due to large crowds and the concern of COVID-19 spreading. So if you're planning a summer vacation, you might want to think again. The night team's Jaffney Gray reports. If we do the same that we did for Memorial Day, in which we have large group gatherings, we are going to continue to see an uprise of cases. With the number of COVID-19 cases still on the rise, county and hospital officials are highly discouraging large gatherings on Independence Day. Out of an abundance of caution, we know that those places where we got a lot of people gathering at once become disease vectors if the virus is, is, being, con is being passed around in the community. Summer vacations are also a concern. If we go somewhere and we possibly expose somebody or get exposed and then transmit it to other individuals. The U.S. Army Corps of Engineers at Canyon Lake is making adjustments to minimize the spread of COVID-19. They're temporarily closing recreational areas on weekends and holidays. With the pools closed and everything, um, um, I don't know. We might just have to take it to the backyard and the sprinkler. Should you go on vacation, you need to consider precautionary measures on your return. No one wants to quarantine themselves for 14 days. It's hard, but that's what it takes. So that they don't expose anybody else. If they have those potential exposures, then they are going to continue to expose other people by meeting with them. Dr. Mandy Svatik says their biggest concern is having another spike on top of this spike. She says that leaves a potential for running out of hospital resources. We don't want any family to be in this sort of situation where the decision making has to be, is this patient sicker than this patient? What their life means over this patient? We want an environment that we can provide care to all people. Jaffney Gray, KSAT 12 News. San Marcos River Parks are also set to close at 8 p.m. this Thursday due to the surge in cases. The city's dog parks, skate parks, and natural areas will remain open.